Hi Kane, um, congratulations on the win. Um, how big a test was that? Recording in progress. Yeah, um, well obviously it's the <clears throat> the pinnacle, wasn't it really? Um, being involved in, in the final and you know, against a, a formidable side and that of India, um, they certainly showed their quality and, and for us it was you know, a lot of heart that um, allowed us to to stay in the game for long periods. I think we saw both teams grab momentum at, at certain points in time and then, you know, to have the <clears throat> the sixth day uh, as backup due to weather and, and see both teams have um, a real opportunity of a result meant for a you know a fantastic game to be a part of and for us you know a very proud moment in our history and and a, a proud moment just as a, as a team really to to stick to what we do well and and come away and and come away with the win which is um, you know a really great feeling. And how hard was it out with the new personally batting not only today but yesterday as well. And how much did the work come into it? Um, yeah, I mean, I I had that injection, which was was definitely helpful. But I mean, in elbow side batting was was very very difficult, and you know, I think that's um, due to the quality that that India have um, in their bowling attack. It you never felt in um, the the pitch offered throughout the game. We saw that the scores were um, relatively low, but. It made way for a fantastic game of cricket, and um, you know a lot of credit to, to the way um, you know our group adjusted, um, stayed in the in the battle because it, it was a battle. No one, I think, no one with the bat really got momentum at any point in time. The ball kept going past the outside edge, and there was always um, you know opportunities that were, were coming. So. Um, you know, a game that ebbed and flowed, and <clears throat> yeah, special feeling to to be on the right side of the result. Hi team, congratulations on the victory. I just wanted to ask, after the disappointment of 2019 World Cup final, how satisfying is it to win the ICC title? And after, and after losing two days to rain, did you give yourself a chance of winning the match? Looking at how you were still batting in the first innings. Yeah, I mean, oh. Well, first of all, a, a fantastic feeling. Um, <clears throat> 2019 was a great occasion and, um, and a brilliant game of cricket as well. Um, but obviously a, a slightly different feeling being um, you know, on the right side of the, the result for, for us and, um, you know, and also a, a part of a, a great game of cricket and a great occasion where you know, it was the, the first, uh, I suppose, official um, World Test Championship. And um, you know, that is a, a really good feeling and I suppose... Having the, the backup day scheduled in was a, a good initiative and there's always a chance of weather in this country and we certainly saw plenty of it but um, but also we saw a surface that offered throughout the whole game and, and brought all bowlers um, into it whenever they had the ball in their hands and um, and you know I think both teams knew that because of that coming into the last day there was a, there was three possible results and that was win, lose and draw and um, and we saw that things can happen quickly. We, everybody's seen that when you play in this part of the world. And um, fortunate for us, they they managed to early on in the day, and it, it gave us a real opportunity. Hi, Kay. Well played um, <coughs> today. Just um, wanted to ask about how special it was to be there at the end with, with Ross. You played a lot of cricket together. Um, it was obviously an important partnership, and uh, I saw that you had a few words there at the end. What did you? Uh, Say to each other, it's been a special moment. Um, oh, uh, you know, fantastic to to be a part of a, a contribution and a partnership like that. And obviously, with Ross, um, you know, our most experienced player and, and leader in the group as well. And um, it was, you know, it was nice that we were able to soak up some of the pressure and and then you know sort of score a few together. Although it was is really difficult to come by, but. Um, having a, an experienced head like like Ross out there um, was was certainly helpful, and um, you know a, a really special feeling to be there at the end together and um, and tick those runs off. Even though it was um, you know one thirty odd on, on that surface, you you never felt comfortable. So <clears throat> it was nice to soak up, um, yeah, like I say, some of that pressure and, and put together a partnership. Uh, hi Kane, uh, just wanted to ask, uh, your bowling attack has acclimatized beautifully with the Luke's ball. So considering that success you have got Luke's ball in England, would you like to try it out in your home condition? I'm sure it will uh, shoot the conditions over there. Um, 
Yeah, I mean, there's always talk about balls, but um, I think we saw the way um, our seam bowl has operated with the new Kookaburra ball as well at home was was really good. But they <clears throat> they do enjoy bowling with the Duke. It, it is a ball that um, offers throughout the the whole 80 overs, and, and then you get a new ball. And if the wicket um, is to offer a little bit as well, it, it can make um, batting certainly challenging and, and you see the way that um, some of these quality seam bowlers, we have um, you know a number in our team but, but every side in the world has them, um, you know you're always getting challenged um, in a number of areas with it so um, you know I suppose there's, there's always that search for um, balance between bat and ball and, and I think we saw that in this game, we, we've seen it in a number of other games in this part of the world and we've also seen it back home as well. Oh, <clears throat> no, I don't think um, a lot of it um, stems back to, to T20 cricket um, at the IPL. Obviously, they, they do know each other playing in the same team, but, but as we know, in, in the two different formats, the, the cricket is quite different, um, perhaps from defensive positions to trying to whack him over his head in T20 cricket So um, with a different ball. So it's, it is quite different. Um, but look, Kyle bowled superbly well um, throughout this test match and, um, and most of the test matches that he's been involved in, he's added a, a different dynamic to our attack, um, which has operated beautifully and, and it's been a, you know, a fantastic part and strength to, to our team. And it was great that they were able to do the job for us out there as we did see the, the spinners come into it as well. Congratulations. Virat just suggested that he'd like to see this final played across three matches in, in, in order that, that that might produce a fairer outcome. I just wondered what your view on, was on that. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I suppose, you know, the, the exciting part to, to finals is that um, anything can happen. And, and uh, you know, we, we know how fickle cricket is and we've seen it in, in other competitions and other World Cups and, um, and all other bits and pieces. And, you know, the, the one-off factor does um, bring a, a unique dynamic, um, which does make it exciting and, and all these sorts of things. And on any given day, anything can happen. And um, We've been on all different sides of, of that um, statement. So um, I, I suppose there's arguments for, for both sides and, and I guess the challenge would be um, scheduling in that that series amongst you know, a lot of cricket that's already on, but, but no doubt you know, the, the more cricket that you have perhaps within a series, um, yeah, the, the more you do find out and the more it does reveal itself. But you know, in the same way, it was a really exciting match um, the first time that, that there's been this competition on and, and both teams were, were fully geared for, for the game and it was, a, it was a brilliant game of cricket. Thank you very much. Hey game, congratulations. Uh, so on the commentary, Simon Duan said, uh, nice guys do finish first sometimes. So your view on that and after finishing second in two cricket World Cup finals, how much this means for your country and the sport and its awareness in New Zealand? Yeah, I mean it's a, a very special occasion and um, and a, a fantastic feeling uh, to <clears throat> to be involved in in a, a couple of finals previously and I suppose one was um, you know the the first one was it was uh, was one sided the second one was pretty interesting and and this feeling is um, is a bit different to those which is great and. Um, I know the guys will, will celebrate that uh, in terms of our team and, and our behaviours. You know, we, we try and commit to what's important to us. And um, I suppose people, you know, can, can comment on that or, or, or tag us um, how they like, but, but it's not about being um, anything other than authentic to, to us as a group and, and the sort of cricket that we want to play and the behaviours that, that are important to us day in, day out. So, um, you know, that's, that's something that is important to us as a team. Here. Um, congratulations, first of all, on winning this inaugural series. So happy for you guys. But does this mean anything special? Because it is against India. And um, in India, we are celebrating as if it is our win. What would you like to tell to our fans as well? <laughs> well, hopefully, um, 
it's nice that maybe we're India's second favourite team. I hope that still remains the case. Um, you know, it was a, a great game of cricket played in a, a fantastic spirit and very, very competitive. And um, you know, on a surface that was offering something throughout, um, and every team had a, an opportunity to to win, lose, and draw on the last day. So um, you know, we we know how strong. Um, and formidable the Indian team is. Uh, we've played them on a, a number of occasions and at home and away, and, and then to, to meet them at a neutral venue and um, and be a part of you know the first final is a is a great achievement and and even more special is to, to finish on the right side of that. So um, you know a, a great occasion and, and nice to be uh, a part of the match. And just the final one. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, um, it's a little bit unique, I suppose, having um, a little bit of bubble life involved and <clears throat> and the the number of distractions and um, that's been going on, I suppose, and and COVID's clearly been a big part of that. But it's been great to have so much support uh, from abroad, um, from back home. We've we've definitely felt it. We've seen a number of Kiwis in the crowd, although attendance was limited, but. Um, we always know that the, the Kiwi public, you know, are, are behind us, and um, yeah, a special feeling to to be on the right side, and certainly for all the fans that have been supporting us for a long period of time, um, I'm sure they'll enjoy this moment as much as we will. Recording stopped. Thanks very much, guys. Cheers.